Welcome back to Infigyan, my dear friends. In this video, we have one very, very interesting question from radical equations. Our equation is x equal to cube root of 1 minus square root x whole square over 6th root of 256 and we'll be solving for real values of x. So let's get started. As we have a square root x, so we can write for x to be real, x should be positive. Now I will begin with our denominator. Sixth root of 256. We can write sixth root of 256 is 16 square. So this can be written as 16 power 2 whole power 1 over 6. Using exponent law, we can write 16 power 2 times 1 over 6, which will give us 16 power 1 over 3. So denominator we can write this is cube root of 16. So our equation will become x equal to cube root of 1 minus square root x whole square over cube root of 16. Using exponent laws we can write this will be written as cube root of 1 minus square root x whole square over 16. Now 16 is a square of 4. So we can write 1 minus a square root x over 4 whole square. This is equal to x. Let me write this equation here. x equal to cube root of 1 minus square root x over 4 whole square. Now I will write one exponent law a power b whole power c. This can be written as a power c whole power b. Let's apply x equal to, we will be writing cube root of 1 minus square root x over 4 then whole square. Now I will consider power half both sides. So in LHS I will put power 1 over 2. In RHS we will put power half. Now a power b whole power c this is equal to a power b times c. So these two parts will get multiplied. So we can write our equation as x power half equal to cube root of 1 minus square root x over 4. And power will be 2 times 1 over 2 which will give us 1. Now I can write our equation square root x equal to cube root of 1 minus square root x over 4. Now we will consider cubing both sides. So I will write here power 3. This side also will write power 3 cube root and cube will be over. So we can write our equation square root x whole cube equal to 1 minus square root x over 4. Let me write here the square root x whole cube equal to 1 minus square root x over 4. Now we will use substitution. So we will consider square root x equal to a minus 1. So LHS we will get a minus 1 whole cube and RHS will be 1 minus square root x. Let us calculate here 1 minus square root x. This value will be 1 minus a minus 1. So 1 minus a plus 1 or we can write 2 minus a. So I will write in the numerator 2 minus a denominator is 4. 
now if i will plug in a equal to 1 then clhs will be 0 rhs will be non zero so i can write here for our cubic equation a cannot be equal to 1 so i will cross multiply our terms i can write 2 minus a over a minus 1 whole cube equal to 4 now i will split our numerator i will write 2 minus a as 1 plus 1 minus a over a minus 1 whole cube equal to 4. Let me write this equation here. 1 plus 1 minus a over a minus 1 whole cube equal to 4. Or we can write 1 over a minus 1 whole cube plus 1 minus a over a minus 1 whole cube equal to 4 or 1 over a minus 1 whole cube we can write 1 over a minus 1 and then we can put whole power 3. Now minus I will take common so it will be a minus 1 in the numerator denominator is a minus 1 whole cube rhs is 4 now we can cancel a minus 1 with this 3 so it will be power 2 left so i can write 1 over a minus 1 whole cube minus 1 over a minus 1 let us write whole square equal to 4 now you can see our substitution is obvious i will consider 1 over a minus 1 equal to m so we will get our equation m cube minus m square equal to 4 remember m is 1 over a minus 1 let's solve this cubic first so i will write m cube minus m square minus 4 equal to 0 i will use method of factorization so we will be writing m cube as it is minus m square we will write minus 2m square plus m square which will give us minus m square in total minus 4 equal to 0. Now from first two terms m square is common so in the bracket we will get m minus 2. From last two we are having one algebraic form a square minus b square we will be writing m plus 2 m minus 2 equal to 0 now m minus 2 is common out so in other bracket we will be writing m square plus m plus 2 equal to 0 so from here i can write either m minus 2 equal to 0 or m square plus m plus 2 equal to 0. So from first equation we will be getting m equal to 2. From second equation if we will check as we are looking for real solutions only the discriminant value. So if we will check the discriminant b square minus 4ac. So this will become 1 square minus 4 times 1 times I will write 1 minus 8. Discriminant is coming out negative. We will get complex solutions. So we can reject this quadratic equation for real values of x. Now accepted m value would be m equal to 2. Now m was our substitution. Let us put back. I will write m equal to 2 first. So I will write in place of m 1 over a minus 1 equal to 2. Let's take reciprocal both sides. So we will get a minus 1 equal to half. Let's add 1 to both sides to get the value of a. So we will get 1 plus half. a will come out 3 over 2. Now a was our substitution. 
so a was root x plus 1 so here i will write root x plus 1 equal to 3 over 2 now subtract 1 from both sides the square root x will be equal to 3 over 2 minus 1 or we can write square root x equal to half now we will take squaring both sides we will get x as 1 over 4 this is our final answer now we have to verify so i will write here check equation is here so i will write here x equal to cube root of i am beginning from rhs so 1 minus square root x so x is 1 over 4 square root x will be 1 over 2 whole is square and denominator will be cube root of 16 let's say 1 minus half this is half half whole square is 1 over 4 so i will write cube root of 1 over 4 over 16 this will be equal to cube root of 1 over 4 times 16 in the denominator which will be 64 in the denominator so i can write cube root of 1 over 4 whole cube as 1 over 64 now cube root and cube will be over we will get 1 over 4 and lhs at x equal to 1 over 4 this is also 1 over 4 lhs equal to rhs hence our solution is true and verified i hope friends you will like this video thank you so very much for watching do not forget to like share subscribe Bye-bye till next video. Good luck.